Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick9G. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're gonna go on a little bit of an adventure. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, which you totally should, links are down below. Um, I talked about a dream I had where Don Knotts was in it. And that's all I'll say. That spurred me on to make this video um, because yeah, I wanna go on an adventure. You know, we're all indoors and so it's one of these things where I'm like, I wanna go and do this. I wanna go and do something different. Um, I've done stuff like this before, but I wanted to throw some variety into the mix and let's get on the road. So I'm here trying to look for John Ritter's grave. Beautiful, beautiful. I'm trying to keep kind of quiet, kind of looking around. It's very nice. Pretty sure it's over here somewhere. able to find it guys and gals um, it's it's beautiful here we have that church over there we have this statue over there this big little circular monument come through here and he's right here in the corner and I I got a little teary-eyed coming over here I'm, I'm a big fan of his and um, I remember how sad I was when he passed away and um, I don't know, up to now, this has been the one that's impacted me the most. I don't know why it has, or impacted me that much. Um, I guess he was very young, and I don't know, I admired his work, and brought me a lot of laughs. I'll show it to you. As always, I always bring your prayers, thoughts. Um, I always make these trips for those that can't. And uh, I don't know, it's just. I'm assuming this is available for a spouse. I don't know. Um, there's also there. I always consider myself kind of a funny guy, comedian, I like to make jokes and stuff. I love physical comedy. And this guy has, um, he's done a lot for how I've seen and been impacted by comedy. So I'm so thankful to him and uh, all that he did. And his work continues to live on. So I'm very, very happy to be able to know that it's very it's very unassuming I actually missed it to be honest with you there's just a lot of stuff over here but it's kind of tucked in here very unassuming very you see there's big plaques for other individuals and here he is with the just very small small you can even see this one is huge right uh, so it's just very amazing to see You know, now that I'm back in my car, I've visited those who have wanted to come and visit. I feel like it's just so very interesting how one who's never met these individuals, like myself, feel kind of that emotional connection to them, and I'm sure a lot of you do as well. And 
I've gone to previously other graves. I remember impactful ones were Mo Howard, um, Jackie Coogan. Not that the others didn't. It was just like a peaceful feeling. But the one that hit me the most was John Ritter. I don't know why. I guess his age. Um, I don't know. It's just an interesting thought. Um, if any of these surprise you, let me know down below. Who would you come to visit if you can? Who would you like me to visit in the future in the Southern California area? There's more I'd like to plan. I don't know if I want to do more of these, meaning like I want to do them more regularly or more often. Let me know. It's all driven by your guys' wants, your love for the channel, your support. So I really do appreciate it. It's really hot today, so I'm like sweating. Plus, it, you know, you're outside, you're walking out a lot. It gets kind of warm. So I definitely have the sun out on me but it's worth it it's it's wonderful it's a very impactful experience because i feel like this is the only thing that a lot of these individuals we have like a lot of the sets are destroyed a lot of the memorabilia okay there's a lamp great but these are the individuals themselves they're not here longer with us but this is what is left this is what we can come and remember and have that connection with um as they say we all are dust but we get to, we can visit that dust. And the fact that a lot of these are in between others that are not actors, that are not super famous. Maybe they're rich, I don't know, because this is a rather wealthy um, cemetery. You have someone who's maybe never on TV next to someone who made their life on TV. Um, and then the people next to them maybe don't even know who the other person is. It's just so fascinating. That's who they end up with. It's just all these feelings, thoughts, emotions. I appreciate it. I thank you so much. Um, I do look forward to these. It's actually very peaceful. There's not a lot of people out here. There's actually other uh, funerals actually happening in the presence. I can even see up on the hill over there. Um, I can show you. Zoom in that far. Those cars are all there for a funeral that's happening over there behind me as well. So there's all these funerals happening at the same time. There's even some people getting out of their car over there to walk to a funeral over there. They're, it's, it's a happening place. People have their masks on and um, it's definitely um, a different world. Thank you so much for joining me today. We'll see you all next time, guys and gals. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. It does help out. Some of you have been leaving thumbs up. I encourage a lot of you even more to give thumbs up, to be subscribed. It's absolutely free. It does help out my channel. How else am I going to get to 100,000 with your support? We'll see you next time. And don't forget, guys and gals, be hopeful. Thank you so much, especially to my Diamond Tier patrons. Gary N., Lori K., Yasmin G., Citizen Kane, David D., Paul T., and Ricky. If you want to be listed here, make sure to go to Patreon where you have different exclusive items that you can enjoy.